Welcome back to another episode of What's in the Box? Thank you for joining me again. As you can see, we're doing a double today. We have Loot Gaming and we have the Halo Legendary Crate. Uh, these were actually from PAX. They were Loot Crate was PAX South. They were at PAX South. Loot Crate was there selling boxes, loot, loot boxes. So we scooped these up and now we're going to show you what came in them. So first, uh, we'll save the best for last. So we'll do the Halo Legendary one second. So we're going to do the Loot Gaming one first. So first item. So this is a Capcom figure. Oh, I can't pronounce that. Okami Den. I'm bad with these. So it's, I've seen this character, he's, it's on Marvel vs. Capcom, I don't know much about it, but I know he's on there, or she, I'm not so sure, sure, but that's pretty cool, it's, it's nice and heavy, definitely will fit perfectly on a shelf or a table. Oh, I feel a shirt, let's just take the shirt up. It's a long sleeve. This is Assassin's Creed, long sleeve. Uh, I don't know which one it's from, but it's just generally Assassin's Creed. Too bad we're in Texas, and this will probably sit in my closet for a while, because it. I'll wear one random coat friend we have. Castlevania 2 Lords of Shadow. If I can. Ah, it's the sword. I'm not too familiar with Castlevania as well, but this, this is heavy. For, a, for as small as it is, this is a nice, this is a nice sword. And there's detailed writing on it, it's scuffed up. It looks like it's been in battle. That's pretty cool. Like, these boxes are already worth it. Uh, let's see, this is a figure. F it doesn't tell me where it's from. I, I know I've seen it, and I can't remember. It's Dragon Age, I believe? I'm gonna say it's Dragon Age. If you know, what it is, let me know, because I'm not too sure. I don't play Dragon Age. And if it's not from Dragon Age, it's from Dragon Age now. That's the best time. Well, you know what? I have the poster, it'll tell me where it's from. Uh, last thing is the pin. It was a, it's a gaming mi mythic. So, nice little pin. I'm glad Loot Crate's been better with their pins. They're not just a, a cheap plastic anymore. They're actual, like, nice pins that you would want to display. So that's pretty cool. Just real quick over. So it also comes, so the poster, it, something like that. this is the poster. But it tells you everything that you've got. I was right. It is from Dragon Age. A Ashes Morgan figure. Yeah, that's that's everything. That one. Now we're gonna jump into the, the Halo Legendary Creed. I love Halo, so this is exciting for me. Shirts on top. What is this? Look, 
Commander Keys. So that's nice. It's just like a, like a set of these other uniforms. It's nice and soft too. I'm not a huge fan of the color, but I don't know. We'll see if I wear it or not. But this is a nice material to wear. Let's just cover the whole table. Oh, this is. Oh, let's. It's all bent up. UNSC folder. Let's see what's in it. Oh, dropping stuff. Uh, so this is a photo of the Halo ring. One of the many in the series. Apparently not destroyed yet. And this is a, a close-up of the ring that actually shows you that a lot more goes on on the ring than it just being a ring. So that's pretty cool. Uh, this is kind of a, an email or some sort of... That's not really important. I mean, if you want to Pause it and, and see what it says, be my guess. And what is this? Installation 04 Public Library. So I got a library card. You know, you know what they say, having fun isn't hard when you have a library card. So, there you go. Let's see. What is this? <laughs> it's an energy sword from the Covenant. So now I have two swords. A human medievalish sword and an alien energy sword. That's amazing. I'm gonna start a sword collection apparently now. I love this. I love this a lot. Create screenshot Halo icons. Okay, so these are, they're pretty cool in their words. I'm not too sure how I feel about it, because it's the figures, but like Master Chief, and you have a grunt. But like, you kind of, I don't know how I feel about it, because Master Chief kind of has a big head, and I love Master Chief, but that's a little kiddish. But I just found out. So it attaches, like it's supposed to be like that. So let me just attach it real quick. And the Master Chief goes here. And then it also, so what I found out about these is that there's gonna be multiple ones, and they actually, these bottom pieces actually connect, and I believe it makes a, an actual like circle of however many you're adding onto it. So there's, you get multiples of them, and you have a whole, basically a whole circle of just different figures. I think the last one was, it was a, a red Spartan and a blue Spartan fighting, I believe. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I actually like that because it has this machine gun. Let's see. What's this? <laughs> I now have a mug that is a plasma grenade. That's nice. That's nice. That's not gonna break well you just can't put it in the microwave that'll probably have a lot of that probably won't sit well in there yeah do not microwave <laughs> so just pour your hot coffee in there hopefully it doesn't blow up maybe it will it's the covenant getting you can't trust the covenant so, oh, so last but not least we have the pen that's right yeah we'll go 
from my, to my understanding, there was two different pins. I think there was a silver one and a gold one. Apparently, I got the gold one. So that's pretty cool. Like I said, Loot Crate's been doing a lot better on their pins. They're not crappy plastic ones. They're actual nice material. So they're actually worth keeping. So I guess uh, we'll do a quick recap on all this. Like I said, you have the the two pins, the mythical and the legendary crate. The plasma grenade mug blinked out for a second. The halo figure. Can't go anywhere without your library card. Your pictures of the rings as well. This nice shirt. Still decide if I'm gonna wear it or not. If you know the name of this character, tell me. Cause I, I see it and I don't know. Same goes with with the dragon. Oh, well, I mean I just found out the character. Never mind. Don't tell me about this one. Tell me about this one, because. I don't know anything about this. We got our Castlevania sword. It's beautiful. My energy sword. It's also beautiful. I love this. Probably one of my favorite things in that crate. And then we have the uh, Assassin's Creed long sleeve. So that's everything in the two crates. That's a lot, and it, these are worth it. I think the Halo one is a bi-monthly $40 one, and the Loot Gaming is, it's a monthly one that's $30. So, I mean, I, it, you can definitely check out the, each month it tells you what the uh, theme is for the gaming one. For the Halo one, it gives you a quick, a little description whether, like, what games it's going to be from Halo 2, 1 through 4, ODST, Reach. Um, so that's pretty cool that they do that. If you don't know the, the newer stuff, you know, then I wouldn't recommend getting those. But, um, so that's going to be it for this video. I want to give a quick shout out to Clip Media. Again, they're, they're producing this episode and another episode. They're doing amazing stuff. They're taking time out of their busy days to, to help me out. Because as you can clearly see, as I said in my other video, this, the quality, this quality is a lot better than, than my setup, my room. This obviously isn't my room again. So thank you to them. Check their Facebook out. Give them a like. And if you need anything of, of their work done, just you know contact them though they definitely know what they're doing so thank you to them all right guys until next time i'll talk to you later bye